it me, JT. Yeah, I don't know where I got that username. Maybe it's my name, maybe it's not. You figure it out. Anyway, uh, hey, it's me. I'm really excited to start this channel. I am on a weight loss slash health and wellness journey. That's what we call it, right? We call it a wellness journey. Originally, I wanted to lose 130 pounds. It was not because I didn't like the way I looked, although I didn't. Um, it was for other reasons. Um, so the reasons I decided to take this goal, um, I was l watching a video of myself. I recorded a Snapchat of myself petting my cat, Dio. And I could hear myself going, okay, <sighs> 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 it was winter, it was cold, and I was sitting on the couch relaxing. I should not have been heaving. I was heaving because that's the way I breathed. This is one of those moments where you realize, oh, the way I feel, the way I look, and my health all do kind of are rolled up in each other. Yep. Also, I did not like that. Uh, I like going out dancing. I like going out with my friends. And I have a personal style I like to wear. And uh, it has nothing to do with being a big girl. I just like to wear short skirts. And I am not a fan of the fact that um, they only make short skirts for big girls uh, that are either all the way down to like below my knees or basically I just have to be comfortable with the fact that my butt's hanging out and I'm okay with it but it's super awkward for my friends and family. Uh, so I'm a high school English teacher and one of the things I love to do is when I'm teaching or when my students are working independently, I like to just be able to crouch down next to a kid and be like, hey, so do you understand this? How can I help you? Get down on their level rather than like looking down on them. Not that I look down on anybody, but. And it was really awkward when I couldn't get back up one time. Or when I like, <laughs> getting down. I'm just, I'm walking around a classroom. It really shouldn't be that hard. And yet it was. That's another moment for me. Here's a part where I talk about uh, like my journey so far, where I've been, where I'm going. So I lost weight uh, about probably seven years ago. Yeah, seven years ago. Um, and what I did then was I was doing a Couch to 5K program and my aunt and I were doing a 17 day diet. And it worked really well because we ate really well together all the time. I was substitute teaching, so I had a lot of control over my schedule. And uh, it was just a different, and uh, you know, we were keeping each other accountable. I was working out all the time. It just wasn't a lifestyle I could keep up with once my body got a little older. I did lose a lot of weight. I think I lost 60 or 80 pounds at my thinnest time where I wanted, I'm a little bit bigger than where I, my eventual goal is. Insert picture here. What I have found though is every time I try to repeat that, a diet like the 17 day diet is not something you can live with. Um, to those people who can live doing juices, or doing cleanses or doing extreme dieting, more power to you. Uh, but I, I cannot. Um, I don't know if it's because I don't have the willpower or because I need more structure than that, or because like my lifestyle keeps me so active that I'm always burning calories. So like I need to keep fueling myself. But yeah, that doesn't work for me. Um, I would find that like I would try juicing and then like by lunch I would get headaches so bad I felt like I was going to pass out and uh, no amount of just keep pushing made it work. So after doing a lot of research and self-reflection and wondering if it was me that was a failure or just science. Uh, in this channel I'm going to be doing a lot of things. I'm going to be tracking my progress. I'm going to be talking about my process. I'm going to be talking about my successes. And I'm going to be talking about my struggles. Do you like my alliteration? I'm an English teacher. I tried. But ultimately, I'm making this because people ask me to. Yes, I crack under pressure. Um, so, 
Here comes that point in every YouTube channel where the person says, What content do you want to see? But no, actually, because I don't know what I'm going to be doing with this channel. If, other than those four things I said, progress, process, uh, success, and struggles. Um, so what kind of things do you want to hear about? Do you want to hear about the workouts I'm doing? Do you want to hear about how I handle my anxiety? Do you want to see some meals I make? Do you want to know what inspires me? Uh, do you want me to make just bad jokes? Because I can do that. Um, either way, you know what I'm going to say now. Like, subscribe, and leave it in the comments below. Meow, 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 meow,